Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with another two box break of 2020-2021 Panini Mosaic UEFA Euro Soccer. Random country break number 13 from a fresh case. We sell 12 spots. Everyone gets two countries from that list below and all card ship. Big thanks to this group right here for getting in on it. And there are all of the uh, countries right there. Let's roll it, let's randomize it. Four and a one for names and countries. One. Two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five, we've got Matthew Shira all the way down to down to Matthew Shira again. Let's get his names into all the names into column A. Four and a one, five times for the countries. One, two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five, we got Portugal down to Belgium. All right, Matthew has Portugal, Steve has Poland, Matthew with Ukraine, Italy, Scott with Austria, Turkey, Lucas with North Macedonia, Taylor with France, Scott with Spain, Sam with the Czech Republic, Scott with Switzerland, Taylor with Germany, Roger with Sweden, Steve with Hungary, Lucas with Croatia, Sam with Russia, Steve Wright with Finland and Scotland, Matthew with Denmark and England, Clyde with Wales, Roger with Slovakia, Clyde with the Netherlands, and Matthew Shira with Belgium. Let's alphabetize by country. And while you're considering trades, let's grab that fresh case down here. This is Mosaic Euros. All right. Let's see which two boxes we're going to do. First of all, we're going to go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six on the dice roll for, and we're going to select a column. We're going to use that right there. It's going to be one, so it's going to be the left side right here. Let's scoot these away. And we've got two on the top right here. You can see on the top camera as well. Two on the top camera and two on the bottom. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. And that's two. So we're gonna do the top two right here. And these will add to the pile over here. And we'll just grab two random ones uh, next time. No trades, not even a whisper of a trade. So let's TWC, close up the trade window. Let's print that list. Let's rip. Let's go. Hey, boss man. Hmm. I need your expertise. Uh oh. I need, these are four cards. Two of these need to be paired together as one pick. Two of these need, to be, need to be paired together, together, and the other two are going to be by themselves. What? I I was going to go this and this. I don't. I mean, it seems weird to do an auto with something, but this is out of ninety nine rookie, and that's out of ten. Oh man. Right. Oh man. Yeah, I think I think, you're, I I think your first instinct was right. Okay. Pair like a rookie relic with an auto. Well, no, no, this is by itself. These two are by themselves. Oh, these two are by Those themselves. Those two are going to be together. Oh, you're saying these two should be yeah, together. Yeah, that's what I was going with. That's out of 10. Oh, that's a, boy. I mean, big time rookie out of 99. Yeah, James Weissman. And then he's good, but it's a duel, and that's out of 99. Well, why don't you combo these two together then? And keep the auto separate and put the relics together? I think this by itself is bigger than that by itself. Do you know what I mean? No offense to the Harrington fan. Yeah. All right, yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, let's do it that way. So. Because okay. it's either going to be with this or with that other auto. Right? Yeah. And I mean, that's out of 10. Yeah. So that's out of 99. Okay. Cool. All right. There you go. There's the next one right there. Yeah. Steve Birch, I would love to do a Noir. I've, I've been... I know, I know it's a higher end product, but I've been pushing for that all day. We've got to get at least a third case done before we call it a night. 
And you know, the sooner we do that, the sooner we could probably maybe get another one done too. Mosaic, help me out here. I hate when these packs don't cooperate when I'm trying to slow down the break. ship and you know these rookie parallels that's for Slovakia that's going to go to Ryan uh, Roger that is and those are the ones that you want to maybe hold on to see what happens it might be worth looking up a lot of these cards as I've said in a lot of these videos you know, because it'll, uh, I mean, Cristiano Ronaldo is always popular in the secondary mar market. And I think that could be cleaned off. There's a little, like, almost like a glue residue on that card. I feel like you can carefully clean that up, Portugal. That's for Matthew Shira. I don't, I'll, I, I'm going to leave it alone because I don't want to scratch up the card, but there are ways to, to maybe clean that up. The Italians look good. There's Di Lorenzo for Matthew Shira. There's Attila Salat, uh, Zalai, that is, 66 out of 99 for Hungary. That goes to Steve Wright. Jaden Sancho made a move to Manchester United. And if England have a good rest of the tournament, See some uh, see some increases on that card value. I'm use up all my containers here. Next half here. Sorry, I have to get a container for this break. Where's our auto? And there's one auto a box. I was telling people in the previous break of this. Might be a good time to maybe buy low on Killian Mbappe. Are people down on Killian Mbappe right now? He's so young that, uh, what is he, only 23 years old or something like that? But he may get a couple, you know, if he's in good health. He should have a few more World Cup cycles in him, a few more major tournament cycles. There's the auto. It's going to be Mario Gomez for Germany. That is for Taylor. Nice. All right. Next box.
this around here. Shall feelish another youngster to keep an eye on. Ooh, and a Virgil van Dyke. One of one. Nice. Clyde Dunn with the Netherlands. One of the best center backs in the world. Helped Liverpool win a title. That's my club. Could have been really, really crucial for the Netherlands' success, but he's still working on an ACL injury. Nice. That's for Clyde. Clyde. One of ones out of fives and under. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Nice. I lo love surprises like that. Got a red rookie here for Belgium, Jeremy Doku. He actually looked pretty good on the pitch. Just couldn't quite quite get things going for the Belgians in the other game, Matthew Shira. But one for the future. There's Igor Karatin. Karatin. Another Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah, and so I think we're going to do that Chronicles tomorrow. We want to focus on that Noir tonight before we call it a night. Ooh, this is really nice. Bruno Fernandes for Portugal. Matthew Shira. Nice, and there's Lyndon Dykes. Bruno Fernandes for Portugal, another Manchester United guy, he's pretty good. All right, and we got uh, uh, Barnabas Bese as well, rookie red. And that's, uh, that's Mosaic 13, Mosaic Soccer 13. It sounds like Noir sold out, nice. Thanks everybody, I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you for some more panini stuff. Bye-bye.